Hello everyone, it's Jared, and today I'm going to show you how you can use 3D Builder to convert your downloaded STL files into OBJ files or other 3D file formats. So first make sure you have downloaded your custom character, and then you will open 3D Builder, click Open, Load Object, this is in my Downloads folder, Captain Grizzled. An important note is make sure that your units are on millimeters. That's the, the scale that we export our files at. And if you choose something else, your model will be too small or much too big. So make sure it's millimeters. Import, go over here, save as. And here where it says save as type, you can select the file type. So there's 3MF, STL, OBJ, PLY, GLTF, GLB. So select OBJ, save, continue. This is just a warning. And then this is the MTL file. If you want to apply a texture to your object, just click save. And then if we go back to our downloads folder, you'll see now we have the OBJ file and the MTL file. A uh, note is sometimes that 3D Builder increases the file size by a lot, as you can see here. If that happens, decimate the file before you save it as an OBJ file. So we're going to do this again. We'll import this millimeters. Click on the model, edit, simplify. I'm just going to drag the reduction level to one level here. You'll see that some of the details lost, but not too much. Reduce faces. And now we're going to do a save as an OBJ. I'll name this guy Captain Grizzled 2 so we can compare the difference. Save. And now you can see that our file size is much more reasonable than the one we first exported. So that's it. That's how you can use 3D Builder to convert an STL file to an OBJ file. 3D Builder should come installed by default on Windows computers. If it isn't installed, just go to the Microsoft Store, search 3D Builder, and download it here. It's free.